culture, the way I think about it is it's a way to design sustainable living system. So the students that come on the course, they learn how to integrate everything that is important for our lives. So thinking about food and energy and waste and community and water and integrating all of those into a site, whether it's a small individual household or a collection of households. So in the course, we focus on permaculture design. We visit many different sites to get an idea of different uh, environments within Kenya, but also different uh, cultures. The culture is, is a really important piece. Our students from UWSP are working with students from other, from Kenya or from other countries uh, every day. And, and then we're in the communities that we're in, we're working directly with the community members on projects that they need or want. Permaculture is a way that people can design their settlements and design their culture to produce all the things that they need for a abundant, wonderful life without harming the earth, without uh, polluting or causing damage to the environment. When we started this course, the idea was that we would bring students here to Kenya so they could experience several different tribes, different cultures across Kenya that are all applying permaculture in different ways. In, in each case, they're using a, there's a, a different context and they're using slightly different permaculture strategies, but the common thing that they all share is that they're building community. So permaculture, on a, in a deeper sense, isn't really just based on about land use. It's about how to bring people together. I decided to come on the Kenya trip because I've never really learned about practical sustainability. Obviously in a lot of our classes we get to learn about that, but actually putting it into practice is something completely different. I've never been outside the United States before, so this was a perfect opportunity. I think my favorite part was meeting all the new people from around the world, and I think everyone brings a different perspective, and it was really cool to form those relationships. I really did find this trip beneficial. It let me like do some networking here in Kenya, which is really cool. Like I have people here now that like if I ever did want to work overseas or something, I have projects here that I know I could work on. I think my favorite experience was when we went to Natum. Just all the scenery around there it was utterly and unimaginably beautiful. <laughs> I am so glad. I highly recommend this trip to anyone. You get to learn so much about a new culture and all new plants that I would never have seen before. Um, it's, it's, it's truly amazing. Everyone should go to Kenya.